Hey guys, what's up? Snurp the Ninja here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to download and install the Optifine mod for Minecraft on Mac. So, just saying, this is the version I'm doing this one. It's a little old, two years old, and 10.6.8. Um, this will work for newer versions, but I'll explain a couple little differences. Okay, so now, first thing you want to do is open up your desired web browser. I just use Google Chrome because that's obviously the best. So now we're going to Google Optifine. Right now we are just going to download the mod itself. So click on the first one or whatever one is the Minecraft forms one. And then you'll be here. And then you're going to want to find the newest version. It's going to be the first one that goes up. And right now on Wednesday, July 24th, um, 2013, the newest one is B4 Ultra for Minecraft 1.6.2. So whatever the newest one is, just click download. So you're going to be taken to AdFly, just normal, normal uh, downloading website. So just skip the advertisement and then download it. So there you have it downloaded. Now you can quit out of your uh, web browser. We're not going to be needing that anymore. And it will download a .zip file. So wherever this goes, just drag it to your desktop. Mine is set to download to my desktop, but if yours isn't, just drag it there so we can do the same things. All right, so now you're going to want to right click on the zip file and click open with archive utility. If this does not show up, then just click other and find archive utility. All Macs should have this. So now we're going to click on that, and now we'll have the Optifine folder. So this folder has all the class files and everything for Optifine, and we're not going to be using those just yet, but keep that on your desktop. Now, in the description of this video, you're going to be able to see these codes. I have these codes right here. They're in the description of the video. You are definitely going to need to use these two codes, and this one you may need to use. So keep these open now because you're going to have to start copy-pasting them. All right. So now you're going to want to open a new finder window and you'll be go click on your uh, home, your home uh, under places, the little house. So now that you're there, you're going to see all these folders. These are like your main folders of your computer. As you can see, there's a, a library folder right here. This is a very important folder and it may not be there for you. The newer versions of, of the operating system do not have the library right here. But if you do like me, because I have an older version, then you don't have to do this part. If you don't have to, if you don't have the library folder, then you have to do this right now. So you're going to open up Terminal, just spotlight if you don't know where it is, and then you're going to take this first code, drag it in, and click Enter. I'm not going to click Enter because mine is right there, but this is if your library does not show up here. And what this will do, pretty self-explanatory, says no hidden library because the newer versions have library hidden. Okay, so that's all that that first code is out of the way now. So, oh yeah, also, it's not going to be like orange like mine. I just uh, highlighted the stuff we're going to need to click uh, for the video in orange. All right, so now we're just going to go into the library, click on application support, click on Minecraft, and this is the Minecraft folder. This is where if you're if you if you're new to modding and stuff, you don't know what this is, but this is where like you're going to do all your modding and all your saves, uh, resource packs, and everything. So if you want, you can just see your saves. This is a new... Um, this is, I just deleted and downloaded Minecraft again and all these files. So we'd have a clean, um, some clean files to work with for the video. So you know um, this would work. This is, like, this is like we just got Minecraft and we want to put Optifine on it right away. So all I did was I just made this world a second ago just to test Optifine in it. All right. So... Now, we're going to want to go into this versions folder, and then you'll see, you might have more of these if you tried doing this from another video and you didn't, it didn't work, but this is like all the uh, modded, the, all the versions you could play with, like you'll have, like when 1.7 comes out, you'll have 1.7 here, and all that stuff, you'll have mods, and you could switch between them. So now we're going to want to copy this and paste this. The reason we didn't just change this one and just copy and pasted it is because we want to keep that one so we get a switch like let's say one day you don't want to play with um uh optifine just want to play vanilla then you can just do that if you want so now you're going to rename this to 1.6.2 of capital of you have to do it exactly like this because if you don't do the exact same name i just did then these uh codes are not going to work because I, they're set up as of 
So you, if you want, I don't recommend doing this, just more work. You can rename to this to whatever you want, and then you'd have to change the code also. But I suggest just doing exactly what I just did. So now I'm just going to open that folder, and then also rename these two files, the .jar and the .json, as 1.6.2 OF. The exact same thing, capital O, capital F. So don't accidentally uh, double click on the jar too fast or else it will open and it will screw things up. All right, so now that you have these two files renamed, you're gonna have to open the JSON file. So right click on it, click open with, and then if if text edit comes up here, then just click on text edit. If it doesn't like me, click other, and you could just search for text edit under applications. And then let's find it, there we go. And then you can just click all those open with so you could easily do more modding later. And now you're gonna see all these all these uh all this code. Don't get scared because all you have to do is see where it says 1.6.2 and add OF to it. That's all you have to do. Again, if you're in a later version, you're using this video like a while after I made this, all you have to do is change whatever this is and add what add OF to it. Okay. So now we're just going to save this. And we're gonna quit out of text edit because we don't need to do that now that we now that we rename that. And by the way, like I just said, if you're doing this in the future, these I'm gonna try to update these codes, but if they're not updated in, in the description, you could just change them yourself. Because all you would have to do is rename this. This has to be the same as that and that. So if you're in 1.7, that would be like 1.7.2, whatever. So I hope you understand how to do that. If you don't, um, I'll just try to keep updating the codes in the description of the video. All right, so you did most of the hard stuff now. So this is all fine and dandy. So now you're just gonna get out of here. You don't really need to be here anymore. And now we're going to open up terminal again. This is where you're gonna need to open up terminal even if you did have the library. And now we're gonna want to this folder that we had before in the beginning of the video, we're going to need to use this now. So first, we're going to take this first code and drag it right in here. Then we're going to click Enter. So what just happened is now, as you can see, this MCTMP folder just appeared. This folder is where we're going to put the mod into. So now we're going to open up the folder, and then we're going to open up the Optifine, the Optifine folder, Command A in the Optifine folder, Command C to copy them all, or just right click copy. And then we can X out the Optifine folder and paste all the Optifine files into the MCTMP folder. So we're going to go paste, Command V, apply to all. We can up replace these, replace. It will take a couple seconds. And now all the Optifine files are in here. Okay, so now you're just going to go back. And now we want to get rid of this MCTMP folder, so we're going to copy this code, Command C, or you can just drag it in, Command V, and this will get rid of that, and it will also get rid of the meta inf folder. If you don't know what that is, it's something for like servers and stuff. Um, you used to have to get rid of that just manually, but you can just use it with terminal now. So um, you don't have to worry about that if you don't understand what I was just saying. So we're just going to click Enter, and now as you can see, the MC whatever it was called folder, um, was just um, taken away. So now we're done with terminal, so we're going to quit out of terminal. And we don't need any more codes, so we're going to X out of those codes. And congratulations, now you downloaded the mod, so now it's very easy. So now I'm just going to show you what you have to do to use it. Just double click on your new Minecraft launcher. Go through the development console. Okay, so now, as you can see, if you go to profile editor, all you have to do is click new profile and you can just call it one point whoops I forgot the point <laughs> one point six point two OF you can you can call this whatever you want just call it something you'll remember that it is this version in Optifine and then you're gonna want to select the one you just made one point six point two Optifine as you can see like I have all these so I could quickly play whenever I want play like in one point five point two if I want to and then save profile now you have that there, perfect, 
and now you're just gonna want to um click play and if this worked we should have optifine let's check the options menu video settings optifine has all the optifine video settings you have your old zoom button and everything well since i've deleted all my files i'm gonna have to set all my options again but i did it for you guys okay so that's it i hope that tutorial really helped you if it worked and it helped then please give it a thumbs up because that really helps other people find this and subscribe if you want more tutorials like this or if you want to watch my other videos so thanks for watching everybody this has been nerf the ninja and i'll see you next time now if i hit you regularly i don't think you're gonna die good oh baby zombie oh, look at they're so fast Creep. Where's the creep? Where's the creep?